guys, it's Anna, and if your dressing table is anything like mine, you would know how much of a mess it is and how annoying it is to just organize it. Well, I got the solution for you because this video is going to be about simple, easy ways to organize your dressing table while still making it look cute. And um, for this, I basically used some old jars that I had right old jars that I had lying around the house and um, I made them look a little bit cuter and also I tried out this new technique that is called water marbling normally it's used on nails so people who are good at nail art would know what it is I tried it out on something different though I didn't try it out on my nails I tried it out on this coffee mug and turned out a bit weird but I still like it. I'm a bit weird. So my thing should be a bit weird, don't you think? I think so. So if you'd like to see how I organize my dresser, then let's get on with it. For the nail polish mug, half fill a steel bowl with warm water. I used a steel bowl because it's going to be much easier to clean in the end. Now drop in some of your old nail polishes. Try to make sure that the nail polishes aren't older than 5 years because if they are then it'll end up a little bit clumpy like mine did. Now using a thin stick, break up all the little nail polish bubbles. I used a chopstick for this and once all the bubbles have been broken up, dip in your mug. Make sure it's a ceramic mug because it won't stick to anything other than ceramic. Make sure that every little bit of the mug is covered as much as possible and yeah, that's pretty much it. For the red jar, spray paint the inside of the jar with red paint. Make sure that it is all nice and evenly covered. Once that's dried, spray paint the inside of the jar with a little bit of white spray paint. Then spray paint the outside. On my jar, I had designs on both ends of the jar, so spray paint those white. For the yellow jar, spray paint the lid first, making sure that you've covered up all the branding. Mine had branding on it as it was a jam jar and I just wanted to cover all of it up. For the jar itself, spray paint it so that there are four clear stripes of colour. It's quite hard to explain but it should look like that. And I went over the lid again to hide any branding still peeking through. For the pink jar, I spray painted the lid first once again. And for the jar itself, I spray painted it the exact same way as the yellow. So I made sure there were four stripes of solid colour inside. And after that, I went over the lid once more just to make a more solid colour. For the mint jar, I had the base face up and I dripped the paint over the sides as I thought that looked really cool. For the lid, I spray painted the whole thing a nice solid colour. Once the outside was dry, I spray painted the inside with little spritz of white and I went over the edge again making sure the drips were a bit more prominent. I spray painted the lid once again just to have a more solid colour. In the mint jar, I stored cotton balls as you can see. I did this because I have so many cotton balls and because this was a nice big jar, I thought it should fit them all very well. For the yellow jar, I glued on top of it a old doorknob that I had because I thought it looked really cool and added a bit more of a unique flair. And inside I stored some of my lip products because I have so many and they're all very pretty so I wanted them to be shown. 
In the red jar I stored my hair ties because the old jar that I had them in was far too small as I'm constantly buying new ones because I think I need them or because they keep breaking. So I shifted them to a bigger one. In the nail polish mug I stored my favourite makeup brushes. Now this is a little bit weird but in the pink jar I stored my tissues because I thought it looked really really cute and it's just a unique way to store your tissues. If you guys enjoyed the video then be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel the button is right there and let me know in the comments below if you're gonna try any of these different things out because I'd be really interested to know if you enjoyed it and um, I think that's it so I'm gonna go now I'll see you guys all next week bye